Alright, here's our man Mike setting up to do some more studs. He's got them all laid out in a row. And we're also gonna uh, we're gonna watch him do a couple of these. Yep. Let her rip. Uh, with that ceramic in place, it's not necessary to uh, to wear a welding hood, but you may want to wear some uh, definitely some protective glasses and um, have the proper safety. All right, uh, here he is setting another stud, placing the ceramic in the in the gun. All right, he's gonna. Uh, Place the gun on the crosshairs, our layout. Right. Now, anytime. Alright, these are a very strong weld. They cannot be broken at the weld. The only way they can be broken is on the Nelson stud or the uh, whatever type stud you have. And they will only bend and, and fail at the stud, not on the weld. It's really important that you adjust this machine so it's getting perfect welds every time and test it for the bend test and make sure that they got a perfect weld every time. Fire now. Three, two, one. Mike's a little bit eccentric. <laughs> he loves playing along. <laughs> hey, you like a movie star, right? <laughs> You're going to be on YouTube now. All right, after this one, we're going to have a look at uh, exactly what equipment we have besides this gun. And as you can see, we can uh, have a pretty fast pace if you got your layout ready and your uh, equipment ready. All right, now let's go look at the, the uh, power supply. Uh, it's so fun to watch this. All right, the power supply is over here. It's not this 400 amp welder is not enough power, believe it or not, to drive them studs. Here's the actual power uh, box, the weld unit. This is supplying, uh, I don't know, it's, what are the settings? Let me zoom in on the settings here. All right. For the uh, three-quarter Nelson studs, we're using 0.89, roughly almost a full second, and the current is 1,500 watts for that one second. Now, here's a, uh, this is a power plant for that welding machine, and this is a 220K which is 220,000 watts. A very big power supply. This is the equipment that you need to do studs, weld studs. That's it.